Jubilee's Ahmed Kolosh has actually recaptured the local parliamentary seat there after beating Kanu's Ibrahim Sheikh in the by-election that was held yesterday. Let's bring in Faisal Abdurrahman. He's live in Wajir with more details. Faisal, how is the reception there? Trevor, it has been a long day and night of voting and tallying final result here in Giriftu tallying center as the result were just streaming in, in drips and drops. And finally, it is official now that Ahmed Kolosh of Jubilee is the winner, garnering 11,053 uh, votes against his contender, Ibrahim Sheikh of Kanu Fresh, who garnered 6,532 votes. But uh, it was a sign of maturity after the Kanu candidate, uh, Sheikh Hans, of his counterpart, uh, counterpart Ahmed Kolosh, uh, promising to work together in better in, and bettering what dear West constituency and uh, just to give you a brief is that for the last 27 years this constituency has been leaning in the opposition side and this is the first time that they have joined they are sitting uh, a ruling party that is Jubilee uh, 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 and remember they are 27,544 registered voters here in this vast constituency and the turnout was 63 percent over 17,000 votes were casted in uh, the mini poll uh, which was conducted yesterday in Wajia West constituency Trevor and uh, a, a lot of ululation celebrations going on in Giriftu and Wajia West in large but uh, what was important we what what was important was that the election went peacefully and the candidates uh, shake their hands and the people of Wajia West decided that Ahmed Kolosh will lead them in the remaining uh, years uh, 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 in, in Wajia West parliamentary uh, seat, uh, Trevor. Thanks, Faisal. That's Faisal Abdurrahman speaking to us from Wajir, where it's now official that Ahmed Kolosh has recaptured this local parliamentary seat. He spoke earlier on to residents there and several people and got their reactions after the, the trickling in of the results came up and now Ahmed Kolosh was declared. Let's listen to what they had to say earlier on. We as a county, we had a lot of challenges for the past uh, few years, about two and a half years. Uh, we have not been stable in Wajia County as a whole. I will urge all leaders uh, to impress unity, to impress the handshake, so that we can be able to steer uh, the development for our people and for this region and as a whole. The people of Wajia West have made their decision, and the decision is Ahmed Kolosh. I would like to wish, congratulate him, and wish him all the best in his endeavors as a member of parliament for Wajia West. It has been, been fairly a peaceful campaign. And uh, I'm asking, I, will, uh, I call upon my supporters to keep the peace and work with him as their new member of parliament. Member of parliament elect. Eh? I want to thank the people of Wajia West. I want to thank the mothers, the people who do not have one meal of a day, who on the scorching sun stood and made their decisions. I want to thank my friend, colleague and competitor, and for the worthwhile competition. Of course, it has been fair. The elections have been peaceful. I want to thank the party leader, His Excellency the President, the Deputy President, members of Parliament across board, whether with uh, Kanu or Jubilee, who have come to support us. Uh, I want to assure the people of Wajia West and my colleague Ibrahim that this constituency will be one, that the people of Wajia West will be one, that will all be working together for the benefits of the people of Wajia West. I am sure that his plan and manifesto combined with mine will be the best for the people of Wajia West. The constituency returning officer hereby de declares that Ahmed Kolosh Mohammed of ID number 2165 7019 has been duly elected as the member of National Assembly for Wajir West constituency 
in the election held on 25th day of April 2019. Constituency Returning Officer Maurice Kepoi Darian Fari. Yeah. Okay. Oh. 